Rio Ferdinand question, where are the racists now after Buke Osaka was among the scorers in England's penalty shootout win over Switzerland, just three years after he and two teammates were racially abused for missing efforts in the Euro 2020 final. England won the shootout 5-3 after the Euro 2024 clash finished 1-1 following extra time, with Cole Palmer, Saka, Jude Bellingham, Ivan Toney and Trent Alexander-Arnold all dispatching their kicks. The joyous scenes were a far cry from the misery of England's shootout defeat to Italy, which saw Jadon Sacco, Marcus Rashford and Saka all miss their kicks as the Azzurri won 3-2 to claim the trophy. Much of the aftermath was dominated by vile racist abuse towards the trio on social media from a select group of fans, and BBC pundit Ferdinand made a dig at those who were involved in the abuse after England scored all five of their penalties against Switzerland. Writing on his Twitter account, the former Man United and England defender asked, Where are the racists now? Probably still celebrating. The abuse three years ago led to widespread condemnation with Gareth Southgate calling it unforgivable, while then-Prime Minister Boris Johnson and the FA also made statements. It led to 11 arrests in connection with the abuse, with one man sentenced to 10 weeks in prison after live-streaming himself abusing the three players on social media. Meanwhile, a teenager was given six weeks in prison for sending a racist tweet to Marcus Rashford. Leighton Orient also said it had issued a life ban to a fan connected with the abuse. There have been increasing calls for social media companies to get tougher on supporters found guilty of abusing players after a series of incidents in recent years. Tony and Nicholas Jackson were among the players targeted in the Premier League last season. After Saka's moment of redemption against Switzerland, Saka, who was not selected.